Hello and as mentioned previously, well there were quite a few other brands showcasing some uh, novelties throughout Geneva during this crazy SHH week. It's already complicated for us to see all what is going on simply at the SHH, but we still managed to check a few things and we visited for instance more affordable brand Maurice Lacroix, which came with a pretty playful and surprising innovation among other new watches. But uh, uh, further than this, uh, Maurice Lacroix is also part of these brands that have abandoned Basel World for a different way of showing their timepieces uh, to their customers. So let's find out more about this. Yes, welcome Watches TV. This year we are here on the Mercury Island and of course Mercury Island is to launch a special project we have on the Icon Mercury. Also, we complement our lines with a special edition of a 39mm on the Icon automatic and then a few line extensions. Was the 39mm some kind of requirement from the market? Yes, absolutely. There's three actual needs we, uh, we respond to. First need is Asian uh, requests. Second is the trend for smaller watches. And uh, the third one is, is uh, also a unisex market. So coming back on the, the Mercury uh, model, the Mercury version, tell us a bit more about this one. Well, the Mercury is something very mercurial, it's uh, very peculiar. Uh, it's a watch that, uh, depending which position you put it into, the uh, hands are completely loose. And uh, it has a memory function, so you always have, uh, when you tilt the watch in a certain position, you always have the right time. And uh, this is an internal development, and how long did it take you? So yes, it's an internal development for our teams. As you know, in the factory we have a team of um, uh, watchmakers, developers, uh, which work on all the collections. But this development took us three years. And to make it uh, really reliable, uh, was that complicated? Yeah, it was a lot of work. I mean, uh, some parts had to be reworked. Uh, we have some parts, for example, the, uh, the weight pallets. They were in six parts at the beginning. The, the development brought it now to one element. So it's, uh, it's a very uh, peculiar exercise also in terms of uh, balance, gravity. Um, on one side on the pallets, but also on the hands. It's um, a very nice uh, work of equilibrium. And continuing on playfulness, uh, uh, you've introduced also a new model uh, using your uh, square second wheel. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, it's the square wheel uh, retrograde. So it's, it's a very nice watch where we unite um, our very known uh, mastering of the retrograde and also our square wheel. So this watch, it's, it's beautiful in terms of you see the seconds and the minutes um, uh, rotating on the square wheel. And on the other hand, you have a calendar for the retrograde function. And you're also introducing uh, black models. Uh, what is the, the idea behind that? Uh, we have a, a request for a full black models. So we have an Icon 42 mm automatic, which is uh, the watch we launched last year, this year in full black, and also the skeleton, uh, Icon skeleton based on our manufacturer uh, base, which is this year also in full black. And lastly, and I obviously I had to ask you this, but this is your first time, I mean, this is the first time we see you here in uh, Geneva. So, uh, how is it going? Uh, weather is a bit cold, but I mean, the place is fantastic. We have a beautiful view on the, on the Jet d'eau, on the Geneva Lake. It's also interesting to, um, you know, commercialize watches at the start of the year. Uh, we were in Basel, which we're not doing this year. It's also linked to the fact that, uh, you know, the, the whole uh, launch or the planning of the launches has changed. Our customers want to see every quarter and no uh, novelties. So this year we have Mercury this uh, trimester. We'll have some surprises for next ones coming up but it's, it's a very nice place to start a launch. So that means that you're going to go like, a, like on a road show uh, throughout the year? Yes, absolutely. So uh, basically we're going to, to the top 20 markets. It starts now. Uh, then in, in February we'll be in Inorogenta in Germany. Then we'll have an Asian tour uh, going afterwards uh, Russia, uh, Middle East and so on and so forth. So we, we cover the whole planet if you want. Well, thank you very much for your time and a good and happy new year to you. Thank you, happy new year and a good start of the business.